Hello everybody and welcome to The Long Dark, Tales from the Far Territory. Um, this was released earlier this afternoon and it's been, at least in my opinion, one of the most anticipated Long Dark updates ever. Um, this was their first DLC that they dropped. So, um, yeah, so part one comes out, came out today, uh, Forsaken Airfield. So I thought, you know, what? better thing to do than to just go into the region blind go into the far territory without knowing anything really and see what the game has to offer i'm super super excited for this so um and i have a feeling it's not going to disappoint so go ahead and create a new run um we're going to go into it in stalker mode um stalker i like stalker because it gives you more item variety and i want to mess around with the new rifles uh new rifle variants um as well so we're going to go into there and we can also pick Broken Railroad, which is directly connected, as you may have seen. Um, the Broken Bridge is now a transition zone where you can go into the far territory. Not too sure what to expect. I really have no idea, if I'm being honest. So, it'd be fun. Uh, let's get it going here. Um, yeah, I'm going to do a feat, because why not? And I think appropriate name for this is Destination Unknown. Because we really just don't have any idea what we're going into. All right, let's see what we get. Well, I'm not sure where this is. Uh, oh, actually, you know what? I think this is pretty close to the broken bridge. If I, if uh, memory serves correct here, I think we go up this way. Oh, guys, I'm really excited to see what this this has to offer. All right, we don't have any weapons, so that's going to be something we got to think about going into um, the unknown, basically. You know, even, even some rocks would be nice. So, yeah, again, I, I want to reiterate. Uh, I have no idea what's going to... what's lying beyond the bridge. I have no idea, so... Uh, this is going to be an experience, and if you if this is your first time watching um, the update, or you want to uh, learn a little bit more, this is probably going to be the place to be. Um, going to just see how much we can explore the far range, basically, the far territory. Super excited. Uh, Got to do a little bit of the traditional looting, though. Nice. Might come in handy. And yeah, too, the... Um, the loot spawns have been completely overhauled as well. So that, yeah, see, I don't think I've ever found that there. So it is really a truly new world that we're exploring, so. All right. Oh, wow, look at that. Look at that, okay. So they have like a little, uh, little rail tunnel in there. Oh, that's cool. Okay, I would assume it's probably gonna be accessible, I would hope. Yep. Wow, look at that, guys, huh? It's so weird being here. Oh, it's so weird being here. Oh, look at, look at the hunting lodge over there. Oh, that's crazy. We've never been able to see, like, the hunting lodge from uh, from the bridge. Yeah, being on this side is, is super weird. Oh, that's so cool. Awesome. That'll come in handy. Um, we could probably put that on right now. Yeah, look at that. That's crazy. Yeah, the hunting lodge way over there. That is pretty awesome. And the visors now, too, um, have a chance to have a hidden note in there. So, um, gives you a new reason to check the visors, which is absolutely amazing. I love what they did with that on this side here. Awesome. That looks so cool. It almost looks like Echo Ravine um, in Wolf Mountain. Super, super cool. Super, super cool. Oh. You haven't even entered the new region and I'm already like... <laughs> I'm already taken back at like how cool it is. It's so awesome. Um, yeah, we're going to collect just everything right now. Just everything, basically. 
So if memory serves correctly, I do think in the trailer they added mountain lions or, or cougars, however they, however they call them. I believe that's what to expect, but again, I don't know, right? Going into something completely, completely unknown here. So, all right, uh, by old world. Oh, 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 look at this far range branch line. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh, it's dark. Oh, it's dark. Shoot. Um, I don't really have anything on me, do I? Yeah, I thought this would just be a classic, um, I don't know, just like a classic bright transition region, but I guess, I guess not. So we have 12 matches. Um, I'm thinking to start a fire maybe, maybe right here. Uh, let me actually, first of all, first, let's take this in first of all. So it's 30, 35, so it's dropping in here. Um, I want to take some tinder. Some of that. I really don't know how big this region is. I'm not sure. I mean, I'm not sure like what's even in this rail tunnel, you know? So if we can get some uh, some light, that way I could see what we're gonna be going against here. Hey, that's that's about good. I'm gonna make some water as well, I think. Listen to the sounds. The new sounds. Oh, that's so good. I love that. I hear the wind whistling outside. All right, we'll pass time here. Pass a little bit more time. Um, that's good. I want at least a little bit of daylight to see what we're doing on the other side here. Um, if there is anything. Chuck on a few more sticks. Just want to get a good, a good light source going. One more should do. Awesome. Alright. Uh, step over. Alright, let's see. Let's see what's to be had in here. Pry bar. All right. Oh, this looks so sick. All right. We'll keep onward here. I'm just my main my main worry right now is if there's um like a mountain lion or a wolf in here, you know. That's why I kind of wanted the torch just so we could see. This is so cool, man. Okay, there's a flare there, so if we run out of torches, we can uh, pull out a flare. Always a fan. All right. Hey, one of the train cars here. That that's pretty cool. Got to make sure. We've never been here before, so we just have to. Relearn all the loot locations, I guess. Ooh, there's our lantern. Let's go. All right. That'll help tremendously. Uh, that weird glitch once you search him. Uh, tells you to search it again. So, yeah, I mean, now there is not really an incentive to keep this torch going, but we'll keep it going anyway. Oh, this area is super cool already, man. I'd assume nothing's really in here. So what was this region called again? It was called uh, something. Far Range Branch Line. Oh, I love that name. Oh, so cool. They really did a good job already and we're not even in the regions, the main regions yet. Wind's picking up a little bit. Ooh. Oh, that's so sick. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. We got a new sound for opening uh, containers as well. That's cool. Uh, I'm just really trying to make sure I, I don't miss any loot here. That wouldn't be a great thing. Cool. Always welcome. Uh, let's just exchange torches. I know we do have some some lantern we could use, but I'd rather use it later. 
Can I jump? I just tried to jump. Nope, not in this game. So one thing I did notice too, and it might be a little nitpicky thing, but your walking speed out here does seem a little bit faster, in my opinion. In here, it's back to you know, normal speed almost, but it does seem to be a little bit uh, faster. Not sure, maybe that's just me. All right, looks like the exit is somewhere this way. And I would assume that these cables electrocute during an aurora, so don't really want to be in here too much longer. You have a bedroll, so that's not horrible. Yeah, so this place, right? This is interesting. Kind of like little, uh, a little office within the rail line. Makes sense. Alright, that's searched. I'm really gonna try to stay away from these lines in a, in a few in a few minutes here. Not sure about Aurora possibilities. This wire doesn't really look connected though. So I think we're okay. But. Okay, look at the matches here. Uh, we'll search in here. Look for us. I have a feeling not much, yeah, not much is going on in there. Okay. Uh, we did find a tube, though, so let's put that on. The sounds. I don't like it. I don't like the sounds. They creep me out. Alright, we'll keep it going. Porch is kind of getting down there. Two different ways to go. Ooh, look at that. Okay, exit's down there. Change these. Don't know what's this way though, so we'll we'll go take a peek. Ooh. Ah. Okay. The crowbar for this one. Oh, that is. Oh no! Is that the outside? Is that the outside? That is the outside. Oh. oh boy, okay. Oh boy, oh boy. Look at this, guys. It almost looks like the Ash Canyon design. Wow. What's that little cave down there? You see that? You guys see that down there? Interesting. Super, super cool. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. Alright, I'm not going to go down here quite yet. There was another way to go. I'll pick this up. Anyway, but there's another way to go um, down the staircase. I'm obviously not sure where that leads, so let's go check it out. Wow, that's super cool. I love that little look there. Let's do look. So much potential to this game. Um, let's just make sure I'm not really missing anything too uh, crazy. He's so cool. Always welcome. All right. Um, if I had to guess what down there is, it's probably a way to get down to the lower level. I would assume, maybe, possibly. I'm not sure, though. I have to see. Yeah, torch is starting to run out a little bit. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. -ho -ho. Whoa, alright. Um, okay. I gotta be honest, I'm not really sure... I'm not really sure if we should be exploring this or up there first. Probably a good question. I think I'm gonna just kinda leave that. We'll take our time exploring. Oh, a little climbing rope. Uh, we'll take these in case we need to start a fire later. Wow, oh, big stick spawn here. <laughs> Not a bad stick spawn. Um, I don't know what the stability of this ice is. It could... I mean, it makes sense if it was fully frozen, but you never know. Is this like a landmark? Is this like Reclusive Falls or something? Oddment Falls. Interesting. Okay. 
Look at that trestle line. Oh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. I absolutely love to see that. Oh, they put so much attention to detail in this. Um, up here, not sure that's a place we're supposed to go. All right, let's head um, head down here. So I'm really hoping to find a rifle, um, for obvious reasons. I just kind of think a rifle is a pretty safe item to have when you're exploring new territory like this. So a rifle is something I would like to have, but I think we'll find that later on, probably. In this region already, you can just tell it's going to be a big region. I mean, if this is a transition region, imagine like the size of the actual regions that are coming. Can't wait for it. Um, just because there's unknown wildlife, I'm going to just take time to take these. There we go. All right, uh, some more sticks up here. I'll never turn down sticks. Wow. Uh, yeah, so there is other things up there. I saw there was a train car, but I'm not sure what's beyond the train car, so we'll have to, uh, we'll have to explore a little bit, which I love doing, so. Oh, boy. This is all so cool. I love the feeling of being lost again, you know? Love the feeling. Just exploring, trying to survive in a place that you just don't know anything about, you know? That was like me in the first few, uh... Oh, rabbits there. Yeah, it was exactly like me when I first started playing this game. I had no idea where anything was. It was just a grind to, uh... To try and learn as much as you can. I'm not sure if this is a thing up here. Probably not. Yeah. But yeah, you know? Ugh. So, so cool. I'm gonna take one more of these. I have a feeling that cave right there is a transition. So what I'm going to do is probably backtrack a little bit just so we can see what's up above there on the trestle. Want to grab these two. Best to be super prepared. Um, okay. So let me just take a walk over here. Not sure what is over here, obviously, but sure we'll find out in a second now is this just a regular cave maybe no oh, okay yeah so this is an actual cave all right that's gonna require a transition so we'll go back up top and see what's there um i don't know what the deal is maybe there's two ways to get into the far range Maybe, like, through the cave there and then up top. If that's the case, then up top I think we'll go through and then we'll come back to that at some point. But, yeah, super, super cool. You, you know it's going to be good when the rocks look like Ash Canyon. I mean, <laughs> Ash Canyon's my favorite region, so one of my favorites. I don't really have a favorite, honestly. They're all so good in their own way. So, Oddment Falls is there. That's a cool name, I guess. Not really sure. Don't really have an opinion on it. Um, yeah, so we'll head back up the way we came. We can. And we have a sleeping, or a bedroll too, I believe. So we shouldn't be necessarily pressed for... Yeah, okay. We're not pressed to find a bed. Although I am curious where there are beds in this region. Man, I'm so excited. Oh, this is so great. It's so, so cool. Um, I just, I do just hope the weather stays clear for us. For us to see uh, what we're dealing with. Alright, back in here. Um, how much fuel do we have? Ooh, not much. Not much. I think we'll traverse this at in the dark. Whoa. <laughs> Can't really see much in here, but... Uh, we'll try. We'll try to get around a little bit. So basically, it's just kind of through these doors. What time is it? Okay. Um, okay, we hit the door. So 
So we're through the doorway. Um, I can see a little bit now. And that's so cool, but it's so... It looks so haunting if you go through here without a light. I tell you, this would be like a... very Okay, there we go. This would be a very, very good zombie game if they added zombies, but... Please don't. <laughs> it's so good as is. It's, you know, it's amazing. It did such a good job already. Look at that. Wow. That's amazing. That's actually so cool. Surfate Trestle? Surfeet? Surfy it? Not sure. I'll have to look that one up. Make sure I'm pronouncing it right. Um, interesting. Okay. Step up here. Alright. Ooh, ski jacket. Very nice. I want to put that away. Always good to see a ski jacket. Uh, okay, yeah, we can. A little confused there. Soda, always good. Climbing rope. Okay. You have the room for it, so I'm gonna take it. Uh, doesn't look like anything is too, uh, too interesting. Yeah, so I think what we're gonna do is probably head down to the cave there and sleep in there. Probably a good sleeping spot. I'm not sure if there's a way to get over here. We'll uh, find out in a sec. Yeah, this looks like to be some type of landslide. Un unless in here? Nope. Okay, that's what it is. Probably just some type of landslide. Um, I'm sure I'll find a way to break this. Um, <laughs> to get over this in an offline run or something. Um, yeah. Super cool. Super, super cool. Okay, so um, I don't know if I want to deploy the rope. I think we probably should because we have energy to burn. Um, before we can sleep through the night, so. Yeah, let's go ahead and just deploy this. I see the uh, hypothermia uh, risk there. What are we at? 6%. Okay, we could be fine. Not too bad of a climb. Ooh, nice rose hips awaiting us. Alright. Oh, left too early. There we go. I'll take some of these. Alright. So now we do have morning activities, um, or nighttime activities, if, uh, if we cannot sleep through the night. So that's good. Um, yeah, so let's, um, let's see what's through here. Uh, it should be interesting. I hope it's warm in the cave. That's kind of what I'm looking for a little bit. Um, probably going to have to use our lantern. hope there's lantern fuel in here. That would be awesome. Ooh, look at this. Ooh, plate layers shortcut. Ooh, I love the names. So cool. I love it. Plate layers shortcut. Interesting. Now, it's funny because I really just don't know what to expect in here, you know? They could really put anything. Anything they wanted. Here. And... I would not know, because there hasn't been enough time for anyone to find out. So, that's the beauty, I guess, of, uh, of that. Um, part of me kind of does want to maybe use one of the flares we have. Probably a good idea. That way, if there is anything, we can be ready for it. Yeah, makes me feel a lot better. Plate layer shortcut, though, huh? Interesting. Ooh, down uh, here. This looks very similar to, um, to the dam. 
I'm gonna go back and just see what's up top, I think. Try to get a lay of, uh, this new region. Ah, I see. Okay, so this is the way out. Um, down there is just kind of a mystery, though. Can I get over? There we go. Yeah, so down there is just kind of a mystery, huh? This looks like the way to go. Um, I don't know if I want to try dropping down. Maybe see what's over this side. Uh, it's possible. Alright, let, let's test it for science here. Okay, so it is possible. Cool. Pick one of those. Oh, it looks like we got some loot over here as well. Not what I wanted to do, but it's fine. Ah, a nice knife for us. Take that, take that. A tinder, alright. That's pretty solid. I'll take tinder any day. So if, um, if my mind is right, I think this would probably link to where that, that end cave was. If I... Yeah, okay. Yep. That is exactly where this links to. Cool. So, the way up there looks like, uh... Looks like the way to go. We'll backtrack a little bit. Man, these regions are fascinating. I think more than, um, more than most, I like the names of places. Just kind of seeing the new names and stuff, that, that makes it pretty cool to me. But we'll uh, head this way. Now it is nighttime. So we're probably going to want to stay in here and, uh, and take a little sleep. Not really sure uh, what's in here. I haven't heard any sounds though. That's, that's always a good thing. Okay, that's the way out. Awesome. And another flare. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Okay. So if I had to guess, I think this is leaving the far, the far, uh, far region branch line, or what, what it was called. Um. Okay. Well, let's see what's out here. Ooh. No, we're still, we're still in the far region branch line. All right. This definitely looks more wolfy, though. It looks more wildlife prone. So, might um, take a few steps in just to kind of see, but I do think we're going to want to stay in that cave for the night because I <laughs> I'm not sure where our next shelter is going to be. You know, can't squeeze back there. Okay, looks like there's two ways to go. Um, that's all I want to know right now. We'll head back in here. Ooh, rosehips. Okay. Let's set our bedroll down before this uh, goes out. Awesome. All right, yeah, we'll stay here. Uh, and then that can kind of go that way. Awesome. All right. Uh, I like to assume that it stays light in here all the time, because it is pretty far into nighttime and it's still rather bit in here. So, thirty-one. Yeah. So that's not gonna cut it. So I think we're gonna put that on. I think that's all we found so far. Yeah. But it does make a difference. Thirty-two. Let's drink a little bit. 
Pull me that away. Save our water for a time when we'll, I guess, kind of need it. All right. Oh, we do have another soda too. Drink that in a bit. I would like to do some maintenance activities though. As in just break down sticks, basically. All right. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, we're gonna put in a little sleep, I think. Drink that up. Awesome. That'll take us through some of the night. Then I think we're gonna put in I think I want to do four at a time, just because I'm unsure of uh, of what to expect. Yeah, it does stay light in here though, so if you don't have a torch, this is the place to be, definitely. Let's see, it's a lot brighter outside, maybe an aurora going on? Yes. Interesting. So it was a good thing that we got out of all those wire, wire areas. I never really trust those areas anyway. We'll do another four. All right, just coming up to daybreak, so put away another two. And that'll make us fully rested. All right, Pick that up. And I think we're off. Yeah, and we're out of water as well, so... That's gonna be something to think about. Alright. Let's see what it, see what uh, daylight reveals. Ooh, it's cold. Negative 11, guys. Yikes. Alright, we'll head on out anyway. Look at that, huh? It's almost like the rocks have, um, they're, like, casting shadows down, too. Super cool. A little dead end here, maybe? I don't know what it seems like. Foundered track. Alright. Ooh. Oh, I see where we are. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, so that's where we came out of. Right, 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 right. Okay. Yeah, that's super cool. Oh, I love how, how things link up like that. Okay, awesome. Yeah, so that was where we came out. And then we took the cave and basically did a grand circuit. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. All right, so starting to get a little bit of a lay of the land here. Um, I do think I want to stop and make a fire, though. That way we can torch walk and maybe heat up a few coffees. Or not coffees, um, some teas. Yeah, I saw the, the little um, entrance there, and I thought maybe that was the way out of here. But, no, it was indeed the way we came from, so. Okay, I think we're going to do... I'm not sure what to do expect here so I think we'll you know, maybe put a fire over over here anyway up now all right it's down through them Yeah, let, let's stop and make that fire, though, because I don't want to be going into this without a defense. All right. Do the good old torch trick. Uh, nope. There we go. All right. We have enough tinder, though, to prepare a few tries of fire, so 
we don't get it the first or second time, it's not a big deal. I, I think we got this one. Nice. So, as always, I do think we're going to make some more water. Um, with two cans this time. Have an update. And I think we're going to slap two pieces of coal on. Seems like a two coal situation. Yeah, definitely. Awesome. Look at that. Oh yeah, nice and toasty. Very, very nice. And I think while we're waiting for these, um, we craft one of these. Good idea in case we get bit by whatever's out there. Awesome. We'll do one more time. Should be getting a little bit of a fire bonus too, because it's <laughs> extremely freezing. No. Uh, half hour. No, we'll do 15 minutes, and we'll do another row sip. Alright. Repair skill for that, really. I'm not sure if that was a feature before this or not. And we'll craft one of those as well. Cool. Okay, we're fogging over a little bit. Um, I don't mind that, but it's when we, uh, when we really fog over that we have problems. Alright, let's leave the comforts of this beautiful fire. And venture into, uh, to really the unknown still. It does, the, the fog doesn't look too bad right now, but if it does fog over more, it's going to be an issue. So we'll have, probably stop and make a fire or something. Depending on how far we have to go here. Alright. Temperature check? 6 degrees. Not the best, but it's not the worst either. Oh, I see a bridge. Just make sure there's no extra sticks here that want to be claimed. Uh, rocks, nine. Yeah, yikes. I don't think we can... I don't think we should pick up any more. Um, I also do want to leave... Some things here, maybe. So, like, the pry bar. Not really necessary. At least having two of them. Um, that's all for now, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's all for now. I'm going to get rid of this as well. I cannot stand antiseptic. Alright. So, if I remember correctly, I think this is going to lead to the Trans Island Railway um, kind of stop area. Whoa. Yeah, I'm not sure what to expect here. This really looks like it could be bested. Ely Chasm. Or Chasm. Steely Chasm. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I'm not trusting this at all. Hey, look at this. Look at the rail splits. I think I hear wolves in the distance, too. I'm not really sure, though. Yeah, look at that. That's the first time, I think, uh, we've seen a split like this in um, in the long dark. The railway line. That's pretty cool. Okay, so it is fogging over. So I think we're going to just kind of go ahead and keep a fire going for a little bit. Yeah, look at okay. So there's there's a little poacher's camp type of uh type of thing going on here. No fire barrel though. Interesting. All right, let's put a fire there. Nope, that's just not how you do it. Ooh, not with that though. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's fine. That's okay. I'm sure we're gonna find a lot more matches anyway. Get some of the oh we okay we burned our only book that's uh interesting all right well let's see if we can get lucky and nail one of these 60 percents 
I had a feeling that was going to happen. Alright. Well, we'll keep going. We have, uh... We have the torches for it. Ooh, there's a wolf right there. You see that? Yeah. Look at that. Okay. So this is definitely not a safe area. Interesting. Yeah, I'm pretty glad we stopped and um, kind of gathered ourselves a little bit. Okay. Well, when in doubt, make water, right? I do want to see what's over on that ledge. So, I might go take a peek while these are going. Um, let's hit a little bit over here. Yeah, a wolf right there. Dang it, that's, this is when I wish I didn't drop those rocks, you know? Alright, alright, alright. I understand. You're excited. I am too, actually. Now, he should be running. Yep. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and do a little bit of a... Of a look-see over here. All right, all right. I don't know, kind of looks like just a place to, um, a place for rabbits, maybe. Not sure, maybe there's a cave tucked back here, but I don't really want to go looking for one. Oh, what is, what is that, maybe? Oh, look at it. Okay, there is a cave. Okay, well, I guess I, I lied. We're looking for one. Yeah, well, let's see what's in here, definitely. What's the name of this one? Remnant Cave. Interesting. Awesome. Got firewood as well. Still not overweight, though. I'm pretty surprised if I... I'm honest. It's a remnant cave. Okay, so this would probably be a good place to set up once um, once you're in this region. Especially if there's like a lot of wildlife down there. That's probably a good refuge. So what's in here? Is this anything or is this... Um... I don't know if this is anything. Just a pretty cool hideout. Alright, well, we are cold, so we're gonna, uh... We're gonna venture back. Not too far. Rabbit, do some recon for me. Yeah, interesting. It did seem like the type of place to, to harbor a cave. Looks like over there, too, maybe there might be something. Alright, not sure what the situation is with the wolf, but... That way? Alright. We're gonna make more water. Can never have too much water. Alright. Um, 19%. Might as well get rid of it. Oh, are we not warm enough with this fire? Yeah, I don't think we are. I think we'll slap a coal on. Yeah, we were barely warm. Got some of our, uh, our warmth back here. Alright. Hour 55 to go. On the fire. Uh, might... Might do some crafting. See what we can do, maybe. Yeah, some some more of those. Should also probably eat something. I do think I want to take a food bonus. Try for it at least. 
probably a good idea. That's probably not a good idea eating that though. Um, not gonna do that in the future. Yeah, we need to find more food. More food is definitely a thing. I don't want to get those rabbits because I don't know what type of wildlife is going to be drawn in. I'm going to put down some teas as well. Alright, let's make... We'll do one in one. Alright. And we'll continue with the water. our teas. Cool. 16 on that. Not really much much else to do. Might make some tinder though. It's probably a good idea. I don't want to be caught off guard without it. And we'll drink some of our nice water as well. Bog settle stick in this region, I guess, huh? Wow. Yeah, so nothing in here. Unlike uh, the one in the muskeg, there's nothing to be had. Which is fine. Nice little shelter, as is. But I think once this is done... I think we have company. Um, I was gonna say, make some rose hips. Put one of those on because it's heavy. Yeah, I knew it. I knew I heard him. All right. All right. I don't think I'm gonna want to use that one. That one's for food poisoning. All right, awesome. We'll continue with the water. Fog is not lifting. Very stubborn today. Um, that's okay, I guess, but we're gonna be looking for a place to hold up for the night, I think. We'd always go back to the cave we were in, but I don't really want to backtrack. Not feeling, not feeling like backtracking on this mission. There we go. Awesome. And we'll take our water. Um, how do I feel about our torch situation? Let's see. Could use a little more. Could use a little more. Two off of it. That's not really um, what I wanted to do. Whoa. There we go. That's what it was. Alright, let's take a little peek. See what's awaiting us. Alright, he's close. He's he's somewhere. It sounds like there's only one of them though. Yeah, okay, right there. Very interesting, so it looks like that train car has a has an end to the track. It's cool. Um I'm gonna uh, do something real quick. See if you can hear that. That might be a little too far. Nope. It's perfect. Actually, might lure him more towards uh, the direction of the train cars. Just so he's out of our way and we don't have to worry about him. Ooh, gotta leave that one. Okay, so he's kind of out of our way now, so we can start to uh, advance. Might see us, though. Yeah, we gotta make some ground here. Looks like a cave up ahead, maybe.
Yeah, good to know. So when you come into this region, um, there may be a wolf. So that's always kind of good to know. I don't know if this is a transition or if this is just kind of a, a walkthrough. I'm a fan of either, so. How much are we carrying? 62? Okay. And I think I want to drink one of these. I think that that was back there. I don't think that's a head, but it might be a head. Not totally sure. What is this? Oh, wow. Okay. This is one of the uh, pictures that, um, that they posted online of the far territory. This was one of the, um, the images of this little sheltered, sheltered area. Pretty cool. A rock slide sign. That's not really great. Um, I wonder if there's a way to go around. Nope. We haven't even walked through the structure and I'm already looking for ways to break it. Kind of funny. Alright, uh, we'll go this way. Ooh. This looks like a transition to me. Oh, it's not. Ooh. Wow, they really make you hike for this for this area, huh? That's kind of crazy. Just making sure nothing hurt it. Yeah, they really make you hike. Um, yeah, no, no joke that the far territories, you know, in the name far. Um, that's pretty interesting. Ooh, it's dark now. I don't like this. I don't like this. Darkness is so. So, it's so dark. <laughs> My. I cannot see anything up ahead. Try to turn down my light in my office here, maybe. Yeah, not, not quite. Hey, piece of coal, alright. Best thing we've found so far. Again, you know, I'm not really sure what to expect, so this is why I'm kind of doing this little crouch walk. I feel like if there was a wolf, I would hear it, though. But then again, the one outside the little train cars there, that one didn't really make a sound until we saw it. So I can't really go off of that. Why, why am I hearing birds? Did you guys hear that? I thought I heard a bird. Oh, because the entrance is right here. Whoa, this is sick. That's, that looks so cool. Wow. I swear the amount of detail that went into this is insane. Uh, I'm not trying to get stuck right now, so I probably shouldn't do this. I'm trying to make sure there's nothing down there waiting for me. I don't think so, so let's keep going. Please don't get dark. Oh, it's getting dark. Oh, no. I, I, I like the light. No. Still just trying to look for any loose items. I'm expecting them to, like, prop a rifle there or something. Something that you wouldn't see, you know? I would like more light, that would be cool. So, first pass through here, um, it's obviously going to be unknown, but at least now we'll know if, uh, 
there's any threats in here, you guys will know off of me or something. There's no threats in here. I see light, so I'm thinking there's not. I think this is the transition, actually. I always say that. Uh, I got light early. Yeah, okay, this is, yeah, okay. I was right this time. So this is leaving the, the branch line. So just a note, everyone. There are no wildlife in these tunnels. As far as I'm aware. I could have just gotten a lucky, uh... A lucky spawn or something, but... Yeah, no, uh... No wildlife, so that's good. I do hear a wolf, though. Interesting. Well, let's go in. Leaving the far range branch line. Transfer pass. Okay. Wow, they make you hike. Holy. Ooh. New music? New music, guys. That's kind of cool. Oh, it's such it's such a long dark style music too. That's so oh, so awesome. So here we are, transfer pass. I'm um, not really sure what to expect. Can I go up here? I can. Um, doesn't really help me out my uh, case though. Hmm. So this is this is a long, long rail line. You can follow this back all the way to Coastal Highway, which you know, definitely a trans island. Uh, it's tempered flat cars. Okay. Interesting. Uh, can I go over here? I cannot. I'm seeing through that crack. Is there anything we should be worried about? I don't see anything. I don't know if you can get on that side, so... Won't try. Ooh, new type of tree. Ooh, in a power grid. Okay. Alright, so yeah, this is... You know, this is new, new territory here. Alright. I'm not sure where to go. There's so much. <laughs> I don't know where to start, but I think we'll start up here. Yeah, what's ha what, what's up with these trees here, huh? I wonder. Did we have a uh, strong wind event? So right now I'm just trying to primarily locate any threats that, you know, would be be a threat to us, basically. Um, I don't know if there's timber wolves. I don't know if there's, you know, wolves. I don't know if there's something else they added. Nothing's re nothing was really super clear about what in particular to expect. But it looks like from my real life experience that these are some type of oak tree, maybe. Um, not really sure, though. I'm sure they talked about it, but I just... It's this one. That detail. Yeah, this looks very reminiscent of, um... Forlorn Muskeg. Definitely. There's a cave up here I'm just going to check out, but... Yeah, it definitely looks very Forlorn Muskeg... Inspired. Not sure if that was the case, though. Uh, let's get down here. I also want to take these rocks, because... You just never know... <laughs> you just never know. All right, stuck in here and see see what awaits. What's the name of this cave? Beadwater Cave. Okay. Ooh, wow! Look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's a lot. <laughs> A lot of stuff. That kind of took me took me by surprise a little bit. Uh, eighty six percent bedroll. I think mine's like eighty three, maybe. So that would be good. Did I get it right? Eighty four. Okay. Either way, um, good. <laughs> Either way, I'm gonna put that there. 
I'm going to start a little fire. Um, I just want more torches. Essentially, that way we can uh, keep traveling. And be at least a little safe while doing so. Awesome. I'm going to take this just so I don't forget it. Um, fir wood. Yeah. Fir wood's a little heavy, so I don't really mind using it when I can. Um, uh, yeah, drop, drop this. We did find some coal, so we can put another one on. Uh, you know, dropping the sticks. Every time I drop sticks, I regret it. I really do. Especially, especially if it's new territory, like this region is. So I don't know if I want to be doing that. At least not yet. I will drop maybe like 20, 24. Nice even there. Okay. So we'll go ahead. Grab some of these. I do want to eat too. Gotta to find some food. Um, that is definitely... Can I cancel that? Yeah. It's a waste of calories. Should definitely get on finding uh, what we need to. And I do think that... Yeah, we can craft more of these. 15 minutes there. Not bad. Since we're rocking not the best clothing, I do think we should probably hook up some teas to make us nice and warm during our travels. Another 15 minutes. Should be fine. Alright, let's take some torches out. What are we looking at for time of day? Just about nighttime. We do still have an hour or two of exploring we can do. So, I think we'll do that. Cool. Hope it's not too windy outside. That would be a real uh, shame. I think I'm here in the wind though. All right, I'm gonna take, all I can take is one more anyway. Because if it's windy and my torch goes out, I'll go right back. But yeah, look at that, huh? Awesome, awesome day for exploring. And explore we shall do. Yeah, look at this, huh? Interesting. Uh, looks like there's a way maybe to go up. What do we have up here? Nothing? Not even a backpack? Alright. Interesting. I always like the interesting corners. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing going on in this region. It, it just looks like a frozen deadland. What's that over there? I see some type of silo. Maybe like a little water holder? I'm not sure. Let's finish exploring this uh, place here. Interesting type of tree. Might be an oak tree. Yeah, look at that, huh? Wow. Super, super cool. I mean... Oh, I always love new regions. Always love new regions. Going in blind, not knowing what to expect. Crazy. So what's up here? Whoa. Oh, is that just kind of... Can we access that? I'm not going to try to scale down, but... That's a big... Uh, it's a big region there. We'll have to see if we can get to it. And we might, I don't know. <laughs> Anything's up in the air at this point. 
why we we get so cold so quickly? Gee, I know we don't have the best clothing, in, but it, you know it's soccer. You know, I did think I think they said that this is one of the coldest regions um, yet. So that that would make sense if we get cold faster. Hey, cattail. We're hurting for food, so I'm gonna take it. Another cattail. Definitely. Um, I'm not sure what our tinder situation's like. Yeah, we're gonna drop that. We don't want to carry more than we have to. All right, we do have to think about shelter. We have to think about shelter soon. I have a torch, so I'm more inclined to just kind of keep exploring a little bit into dark, but I don't want to be... I don't want to not see what, what's happening. Oh, I see a house. I see a house. Okay, that's probably where we're going to sleep for the night if we can. I need a crouch. I don't know what to expect here. Oh, is this the loading screen? Oh, this might be the loading screen, actually. Not sure the secret's over here. What is that? Looks like a huge wall. Um, I'll go over this way a little bit. 64, not too bad. I'm not hearing any wolves. Doesn't mean there isn't any, but I don't think that means they're close. I'm not sure though. So this Trans Island Railway, you know, it means business. It's absolutely gigantic. Um, I mean, going from Coastal Highway, right? Near that Pleasant Valley entrance. Um, or not the Pleasant Valley entrance, the Ravine entrance going into Coastal Highway. So, you know, to that, all the way through Broken Railroad, and all the way through what we just walked through over the past, I think it was like, it was like an hour to get here. I mean, it means business. It's it's long. Long, long, long. Um, okay, we're going to put that away. That was... Um, I got sucked into exploring. I forgot that... We have a torch that we should keep alive. I'm going to, I think, take one for the team and light a match again. That was a pretty silly way not to... Um, keep up with your torch. Chaining. Yeah, what is this? Like, what is this? I'm so confused. Like, why would there be such a great wall here? Oh, wow. This is like a whole settlement. Holy. This, it doesn't look like there's wildlife here, though. I don't want to speak too soon or anything, but... The only wildlife we've seen, Vinket Depot. Yeah, vacant is right because I'm just not seeing anything in terms of living. <laughs> um, that's fine though. I mean, you know, I'm sure there's going to be plenty of wildlife down the road. But I mean, this is insane. Like, what is over here? I hear the ice cracking. That's always cool. Um, okay. I think while, uh, I'm going to just take some of these. Loitering Marsh. Wow. I mean, there, there's a ton of new names to learn in this game now. And what's up there? So much. So much to do. Oh. So, so much. I love it, though. They gave us hours of new content. Uh, we'll use this here. Gotta search everything, you know? Just don't know what secrets. Um, okay. Hmm. 
a broken arrow. Really? Interesting. A little weird finding that there. Yeah, I don't, you know, this is all so foreign to me, obviously, you know. Wow, okay. So, yeah, it looks like we're going to be holding up in that house if we can uh, get into it. I don't see why we can't, but nothing surprises me anymore. <laughs> now, I honestly shouldn't say that because this whole thing is surprising me. Uh, we'll take that out. Check that again. Open this. Nothing in there. Nothing in the fuel cover. As I'd be a little concerned if there was anything there. Oh, uh, no. Check the visors. Sometimes the visors can have, like, notes in them. Another hunting knife. We'll sort that out in the house. Alright. Search this. Ooh, food. I always like that. Always looking for food. Yeah, I think there's just another way up then. Um, alright. We should probably go in the front door. I don't know. It's just a little thing. A little, uh... It just feels proper going in the front door. Rail Island... Or... Grand Island Railway. Interesting. No more trains. Yeah, it, it does seem like that. It's just so cool. It's just so cool. Oh, I just can't get enough of this. Always so awesome. Alright, let's take a peek inside. Oh, I thought that'd be a loading screen. I guess not. All right. Well, it's cold in here. Very cold. That's awesome. Uh, that's cool too. Yeah, I'd assume, yeah, there's gonna be a lot of clothing in the suitcases because this is all a travel, uh, travel heavy place. Wow, look at that. What are these guys? Looks like they're like surveying ice or something. And then that looks like uh, snow removal on the train tracks. Yeah, look at that. That's so cool. All right, we'll get to exploring this place in a minute. Um, I do just want to light the fire while we can. Yeah, I had no idea this place was just going to be a walk-in and make yourself at home. I thought there was going to be a little house transition or something. That's awesome. Super cool. Well, I have to apologize for a longer, longer episode. I know we're way past the hour mark now, but... I'm sure you guys like that. <laughs> I'm sure we're all fans of that here, so. Awesome. Nothing there. Uh, what to put in? Probably two of those in. We're staying the night, so I don't really mind filling the thing up. There's no cooking slot, huh? That's new. Oh, no, never mind. There is a little far from the fire, but who am I to judge? Uh, we'll, we'll move this over here as well. Dead torches. Yeah, we got a lot of a lot of stuff. Lots of stuff indeed. So I think what we can do, maybe I'll ditch this knife and then we can open up this. We're going to get sick off of this. But I think we have the adequate, adequate stuff to uh, to treat it. Uh, never mind. Uh, we're, we're not going to get sick. <laughs> All right. That's cool. All right. Let's do some exploring of this place here. Uh, did that. Did that. Anything in here? Yeah, super neat place. I love this. I could honestly spend so many blizzards in here. That's awesome. Little ski resort. Ski lift. 
Some of that. That's good. That's good too. All right. Uh, is, is the cat better than? It's not. That's fine. Interesting. And then the bathroom. Cardboard matches. Never go wrong. It's pretty, it's, it, you know, I mean, this seems like a very light loot area. You know, it, it just kind of seems like you're always looking for food, like looking for scraps and stuff. Which I do like. I like, I like that. It's a lot more deserted. Farther from, you know, quote, civilization, right? Than the rest of Long Dark. Super cool. I love, you love seeing that. I mean, it's always just so cool. Take that. Um, and I do think, also, I think we're going to have this as well. It's heavy. I, I want to get it out. Out of the old inventory. Awesome. Cool. We'll put that out. Eat until boiled. That's fine. That gives us time to rip down all of these torches. Alright, and we'll take this one down as well. And then one more to do as well. Alright. Okay. Wow. I mean, you know, wow is all you can say, right? I mean, it's really all you can say. They did such an amazing job at, at this region, you know? Hey, we haven't even explored most of it. I don't even know how far we're in. Um, I don't even know how much farther we have to go, but, you know, looking at that little overlook down there, it looks like there's so much to be had. So much more to be had. And then on top of that, you know, haven't even reached Forsaken Airfield. That in itself it should be amazing, so. Wow, we have a lot. A lot, a lot to do. Um, can I sketch out this area, maybe? No, low visibility. So I'd assume that just kind of means it's nighttime, uh, which is fine. I might keep that. Not sure though. And then obviously, oh shoot, hold on. Um, put that away, sir. There we go. Uh, obviously we have to break this down too. Yeah, this is really cool. So I think what I'm going to do is just grab my cans back. I'll take my knife. Um, let's sleep an hour. I don't want this fire to go out while we're sleeping because I just do not know how cold we're going to get tonight. Still lightly snowing. There we go. Snuggle up right next to the fire. Nine minutes on that. Um, maybe I'll do an hour, an hour sleep. Kind of risky, but I don't think we'll die if we have three bars down within an hour. Okay, it's cold. Oh, this, this I think does scale with outside. Yeah, I think this most definitely scales with outside. 23 in here. What's my bedroll? Plus seven, yeah. Um, most definitely. Let's just pass a little bit. Yeah, I thought it was going to be a lot, a lot warmer than this. Still looking at a solid 23, though. I'm not sure how to react to that. So I think we're going to sleep one more hour. Okay. So it doesn't seem like it's too bad. I don't think it scales with outside. I'm not sure. Not too sure about that. Um, let's take a dark hole. If we have to start a fire, you know, we can. So not a huge deal there. And we have so much water as well. Uh, you know, I think we do two hours. It's getting a little risky, you know, I, you probably shouldn't do this. You probably shouldn't be doing this, but... Not the end of the world, I guess.
I'm just gonna see if it's a little warmer maybe back here because I know in different locations of a certain location it will be warmer or colder depending on where you stand. Hello? Alright, what's in, in here? Okay, yeah, nothing. Wow. What's it out here? Negative two, yep. Yeah, I mean, super, super cool. Okay, can we not lock ourselves out? Thank you. Hello? There we go. Got a little caught on something. Okay. Um, I don't really want to start a fire quite yet. So maybe we sleep another hour. I think we'll start a fire in the morning before we go. All right, fog lifted. Yeah, I think we can start a fire now. Um, we have a lot of items to do that with, so we'll go ahead and uh, and do that. All right, that do that. Perfect. I like the green tile. Green tile looks nice. I'm not sure if I would use it for a fireplace though, but it goes with the green color of the building. Cool. All right, so we'll put that on. Two of those on, that gives us two hours. So that's good. Um, still have a lot of sleeping to do as we're only half rested. But I think we'll make some tinder first. Tinder is important. I hate getting caught off guard not having tinder. So we'll make that. Um, that's two hours. All right, now we can comfortably sleep for two hours here. All right, cleared up majorly. I'm not, I didn't, haven't heard any wildlife though, besides birds, you know? I like birds. Birds I can deal with, but... Makes you wonder, you know? A little bit, uh... A little bit lonely out here without wolves constantly howling. But, again, I, I will not complain about it. Alright, we'll put in another two. That'll take us right to sunrise. There we are. Oh my gosh, I think this has to be my new favorite um, indoor baits. I'm really loving it. Really loving it. Uh, we're not going in that wind, so. That's one thing for sure. Cool. Um, any food, any food. I mean, it's all yikes. <laughs> it's all yikes. Go ahead and drop that. We'll eat that. That's, that's pretty heavy, so we'll lose Found. Yeah, you know, the push for food, right? I mean, it's not only an exploration game, but it's, you know, also a survival game. So, keep that in mind. Awesome. Uh, I have an hour on that. Tempted to sleep an hour. I actually think I will. Maybe hope for this wind to die down. That would be kind of cool. All right, so fire's gone. We still have a little time to think. What are we looking out here? Still quiet as can be. I mean, what else is there to say? Wow, really, really nice. Super nice. And I do think this is a good place to leave off. Uh, next episode, we'll keep our odyssey going. Um, we'll have a little bit of time on the fire, too, to think about what we want to do. Um, and yeah, hopefully we'll make it to Forsaken Airfield soon. I'm really, really looking forward to it. So if you guys enjoyed, um, let me know. Leave a like, leave a comment, whatever one doesn't matter. I still see it anyway. Um, yeah, that'll go out, but we'll save the game from sleeping. Um, really awesome. I think actually... 
Nah, that that's fine. That's fine. We we slept a few times, so we'll have uh, we'll have time. All right, guys. Um, thanks so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Um, hope you're enjoying this new expansion pass. I know I am. Oh my gosh. I mean, <laughs> it's really just really something cool, something special, honestly. Uh, you don't you don't get this feeling too often in the long dark of getting a new region, um, exploring it blind like we are. So, really, really cool. So, all right, guys, thank you so much for watching, and um, I'll see you next episode, hopefully.